Hey everybody, welcome to uh, February 8th, 2016, Monday. Uh, it's barely Monday, by the way. Uh, I'm still on Sunday time right now. And today I want to announce that um, uh, I recently have gotten another Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, box. And this one is Yu-Gi-Oh! Master of Pendulum Structure Deck. Um, so this is the decks I actually kind of, I think it's these are the decks I like. Or it's the starter ones. I forget. I still haven't opened the Dark Legion starter deck one time. I see them right over there. So here it is. The 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 Master Pendulum structure deck. Now, like I said, I'm trying to get back into Yu-Gi-Oh. I was never into Zexel. Never. But I really like how they're making Arc 5 kind of combined from the last four Yu-Gi-Ohs. So that's really getting my interest in there. Haven't seen anything of Arc 5 yet, but I'm, I'm getting aware of some of the ways to play pendulum which is kind of op but still so anyways here is the pendulum uh structure deck and the structure deck has um let's see monster cards dragon pulse magician dragon pit magician oh really the dragon magicians cool um okay these are all magicians uh noble dragon oaf dragon and wisdom eye okay and then the rest are okay here well i just say for non for Performable Skull Crobat Joker. Okay. Star Geyser Magician. Time Geyser Magician. Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon. Okay, just a bunch of freaking names I seriously can't pronounce. Uh, Fencing Fire Ferret. Recover. Magna Draco. Okay, just some names I know straight up do not know. Uh, Spell cards, Pendulum Call, Pendulum Shift, Pendulum Rising, Summoner's Art, My Mystical Space Typhoon, at least I know that, Scapegoat, Forbidden Dress, Polymerization, ooh, we got Polymerization back? Huh. Terraforming, uh, Trap Cards, Pendulum blo uh, Back, Powerful Rebirth, Trap Tricks, Trap Hole, Nightmare, uh, Eradicator, Epic Virus, I don't know. An extra deck we have, or as in like the fusions and or synchros or whatever they're now. Numbers. Um, Odd Eyes, Meteor Burst Dragon, Odd Eyes, Absolute Dragon, and Rune Eyes, Pendulum Dragon. These sound pretty cool. They're all dragons and magicians. So that's a pretty cool deck. Uh, master structure, whatever this is. So yeah, um, so that is a thing. So anyways, now for the big thing, I feel like it's for this uh, vlog. Um, I actually got this on Saturday. I just wanted to talk about other things. So, this I got for $35, or sorry, $30, and it is something I've been wanting since 2011. It's it's not a game. It's something f as a collectible wise from a game. And like I said, this is just something I've been wanting for like ever so here we go everybody this is uh i've been jealous of my friend anthony that has this for a long time the the marcus phoenix gears of war 3 epic edition statue so once you got the epic edition i believe it came with the console i i i could be wrong about that a console um it came with the, the xbox 360 Gears of War 3 themed console, I think. If not, whatever. Uh, art book, uh, I believe a guidebook. The game, of course. Uh, I think stickers and something else, maybe. But it also came with this big bad boy. Um, I've always wanted this. It does do the one thing I knew about it. It does glow in the dark. I can't show it off on screen, but you just gotta trust me on it. So, I'll show you where it can glow in the dark on. So... Glows in the dark right on these yellow kind of like cracks. Uh, they glow in the dark, including it glows in the dark. Uh, I don't know what these are called, visors or something on his shoulders. So this is it. Um, let's see. I'll show you his face. Um, pretty Marcus Phoenix, like I guess. Uh, now this is, I guess, of course it's used. I mean, there is some smudges and or uh, a little bit of writing, sadly I'm to say, that I cannot take off by myself I might have to do professional work but like here is some smudges on his where is it 
come on, come on, come on. Like his, his arm right here, uh, like black pen or something. Uh, this side, it looks kind of dirty, but I don't know if that's actually how it's supposed to be or not. Uh, right here, his little emblem is kind of faded off a bit, but I mean, I, I looked at other people's like online. They're, that's not actually supposed to be some of these. Um, it's supposed to be like perfect and stuff. So, anyways, I, I got this, and that's something I always wanted. The next thing I really want to get is the Halo, uh, uh, Master Chief's helmet thing that looks pretty cool, um, which is only stores games in it. So, anyways, which I know that someone has it, I just don't know if he's gonna sell it. So, anyways, um, besides that, that's seriously it for today. I got the Yu Gi Oh! Uh, damn, the Yu Gi Oh! Trading Card Game Structure Deck Master Pendulum, uh, from Arc 5, and um, the Gears of War 3 Marcus Phoenix Epic Edition collectible statue. So, uh, please let me know in the comments below, uh, if you are looking for this statue, I'm not selling it by the way, if you're looking for the statue, um, please let me know, um, did you want it since the launch of it, like myself, or just like afterwards, after knowing what Gears of War 3 is, or whatever in the franchise, a year or something after, but honestly, I'm very, like, excited I have this, it's just something collectible that I've been wanting for a long time. The next Gears of War, th uh, related collectible thing I want is the life-size Lancer, uh, which I'm actually wearing the Gears of War uh, shirt, by the way, I just, I just noticed that, so. Anyways, uh, that's going to be a series for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, the video, subscribe, below, and I'll see you guys all tomorrow, okay? Bye-bye.